Hello guys, here I have Gear S2. This is a Samsung smartwatch and I will show you how to flash it when uh, download wireless mode is not available. So uh, first you need to remove these two things. So by pressing here, not pressing but rather pushing it away from the watch, you pull it in your direction. The same thing here, you that button you pull against the watch and you pull, uh, pull the wrist uh, band kind of upward. But what we look for, so you look for that small window, it's the contacts here, they will be hidden by this white piece of plastic like that. So what you will need to do, you take a screwdriver, flat one, thin one, and pry it out just like that so now you will hear you will see here five contacts see so this is the USB plug actually so supposed to be so now we have this one this is the Samsung Gear S charger you can order it on eBay for five bucks or so so you will need to disassemble it, get this thing, and it has minus here on the top, a plus in the bottom. So I will plug it to my computer, like that. So next we, get, we will put the watch to download mode. How you do that? You press and hold power button until the watch will reboot. Now two times power. We got to the menu. I press power button until we get to download. Second option. Okay, now I should keep press power for a little while. Release. Okay. This one looks like download mode. You can see downloading the not tour of turn off target. At the top you see model number. In my case it is a SM-R730A. This is LTE version and every LTE version has this port. I'm not aware if you will have it or not LTE version. So next step you will need to download Odin version 3.1.3 here and to flash it I mean to flash the watch we will need to download firmware so now I have here unzipped combination and I have Full firmware. So you have Odin, and here we have unzipped full firmware. I want to load only this one BL. So in BL, we'll choose here BL section BL. Now we have here BL checked and we have this. Also we can choose here auto reboot or not. I don't know, we're gonna keep that. So next step is to connect the watch. So to connect the watch, I, you should 
plug it that way. And once it's connected, the computer should make a sound. So now, as you heard the sound, you see what it's showing connected port com, right? So this is the watch. So to flash, you need to press on start button now. So guys, uh, flashing this watch, something didn't work out and uh, I flashed this DL file and it says passed and the watch got in boot loop. In order to do that, it has four screws here and you will need to use that kind of a screwdriver as you can see it's something like tree wing I believe it's the same what Nintendo uses for their consoles I mean uh, Nintendo DS, DS Lite and uh, 3ds so you should put push hard and screw these four screws after you can use this tool and we can open it so I already tried to pry it from here Okay, battery. Where is the battery? I don't know actually what is the battery here. Still boot looping. And I cannot put it in download mode. And not this one even so. So what is left? We have one screw here. Okay, where are since it doesn't work? Let's try to disassemble it. One screw here. We have here the vibrator this one
Nicolet. And you can see it externally. Battery is connected here to two contacts for the battery.